I'm Howard Hale. Thanks for joining us for the Cattleman's Corner. I'll be back with today's guest right after this. You've heard us talk about Ag Market Online and how it's growing and changing every day. Now we've shortened the name and made it even easier to find on the web at agsearch.us. It's also easier to find the best ag businesses in the country by state or even by specific type of ag business. And the best news is that it's now easier than ever to get involved and start getting more exposure for your business. Visit agsearch.us to learn more. With us on the program today, Art Handel, Handel Marketing at Rapid City, South Dakota. Been involved with the cattle industry, a field man for the Hereford Association for many years, then Handel Marketing. And when he was younger, back in the 50s and early 60s, showed a lot of steers in some major shows across the country. But talk about the changes that you've seen in the uh, cattle over the years from back in the 50s and 60s to today. Would you, Art? The English breeds, the Angus, Hereford, Shorthorns, all were kind of doing about the same thing on the size thing and so on. And then when the industry decided that we needed to make some changes and probably make them a little bigger is when we started introducing the continental breeds and, and brought in about 67 new breeds of cattle for a number of quite a few years. That was kind of the turning point. And Art Handel, Handel Marketing at Rapid City, South Dakota. Gentlemen, that's been involved with the cattle industry for many years. Thanks for joining us. May God bless. Join us again, won't you? I'm Howard Hale. 